It was the height of Friday evening's rush hour. A commuter train leaving New York City's Grand Central Station derailed. Moments later, a train travelling in the opposite direction crashed into it. It's uh, uh, pretty devastating uh, 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 damage uh, to a number of cars. Um, it's clear that these cars uh, came into contact, ripped off uh, at least a portion um, of the siding of uh, one of the cars. 60 people have been taken to hospital. Five of them are critically injured. A little bit I've seen people flew over places, I almost flew over the seat, but I, just, I held on. And, but I'm okay. The other people just hurt though. What caused the crash isn't known yet, but the train company says the collision has seriously damaged the train and tracks. An investigation into what happened is now underway. It's going to take us a little while to investigate them, to really determine what happened, how fast they were going, and to determine the cause. So it's going to take some, quite some time. Many of the injured have now left hospital, but it could be Monday before the line between New York City and Boston is reopened. Julie Peacock, BBC News.